back to another video. And I gotta wear my mask. Oh. I gotta wear my mask because the pollen is ridiculous. So, hello guys, welcome back to another video. Um, she be gonna take her road trip today, guys. Not far. So, from Atlanta to where we're going is a five hours drive. Tell us where we're going. But then we're gonna take you guys with us for the weekend. It's a sad trip, but at the end of the day, we gotta give God thanks for what's here. Done. And guys, remember in everything that we do, we're gonna put God first. First and foremost, I wanna thank everyone who subscribed to my channel, guys. I thank you very much for all the support and the love. I really appreciate it. And if it's your first time on this channel, guys, I just wanna tell you that welcome to the channel. And if you stick with me, you're gonna get um, some nice content, family vlog, trips, and more stuff. Okay, guys, so come with us. We're gonna take a trip, all right? And we're gonna pray in the name of Jesus. Yes, guys. Once again, we're going to take a trip, it's a four hour trip from out of Atlanta, put it in the comment section if you know where you guys, five hour trip, I'm sorry, five hours trip, babe over there saying, so if you know where we're going, put it in the comment section guys, five hours from Atlanta to, you know, I'm not going to tell you until we get there, but come with me and if you stick with me, you're going to see where we're going. I'm not sure if we're gonna um, do a vlog there because as I said, it's, a, um, it's like a, a sad, a sad, wait, what I should say? It's, it's, it's a sad moment, you know what I'm saying? It is a sad moment. So, but at the end of the day, we're gonna be together. And I keep telling everyone that don't wait until anything is wrong with you guys before you guys get together or we get together because every time we have like a family gathering is always something bad that happened so they had the niece that passed away and the sister to the family i mean the family also because i'm married in the family but yes and today guys is uh, tomorrow is the funeral so you know she's in a better place so we just have to live life to the fullest because tomorrow I'm being a promising to nobody. Hear me? No one. It's not promising to me. So just remember guys, loving each other and put God first in every single thing that you do because He is in control. Okay, it doesn't matter what you're going through. Always talk about it. Always pray about it. And just give it to God in prayer because He will do exceedingly and abundantly things, guys, in your life. Don't ever leave him out of your life because He can change situation. He can break you and maybe other. So anyway, let's talk. So, babies, babes of mine, man of and a few words, you don't have much to say. And a few words.
but we're still riding here go the, the driver and the passenger as always I never get to go around the steering wheel if I'm not by myself they always driving which is good yeah I want to know what's in my mouth guess can guess but anyway guys it's a beautiful day it's um 55 degrees it's beautiful but it's chilly if you understand but um this is gonna go up to 60 so i can't wait for that i don't know where the weather is just fluctuating it's like the weather is bipolar it was beautiful on wednesday thursday it was cold today is chilly you be like you, you don't even know what to think. That's why when you're going outside, you always got to dress in layers. At least you can take it off. But um, when you're cold and you don't have nothing to put on, that's what it is. You have to wear something or layers. Yeah, but I don't know where we are right now. It says Georgia 36 East, whatever that is. We're on the back road when you're going to road trips i don't understand this gps always taking us the back road he's trying to say it's the fastest route but there's no one it's just land trees and schools and nothing for real but i guess it's faster because it have no lights no nothing but when i say i'm hungry i'm not hungry because guess what if i was at work i would eat already but because I'm um, not working today, it's like I'm starving myself. Yeah. But you guys, one thing I do I like I like the um, the springtime because um, the change of flowers is so beautiful. It's so beautiful. But the only thing is that the pollen bother me, so I always have to have. The mask. I'm gonna wear the mask when I'm going outside. Sometimes I have to wear it in the car because the vent is open and then the, the whatever is coming through the vent. So I always gotta um have on my mask sometime in the car. It depends. This one we don't have to really. But yeah, guys. <coughs> What, what I want the people then to put in the, the comments is okay when I am driving I want to listen certain things that's me you know what I'm saying I love music you know when music is playing I want to dance you know but when I'm driving I don't really like to listen music I like to listen like podcasts and certain things that keep me up if I listen music I will want to sleep you know no she wants to listen music I tell her Guess what? You have to carry your you have to carry your headset. You have to carry something to listen music on your on your phone over there. <laughs> As if I am driving, we're not gonna listen to music unless you want to come and drive then. You know? So people just put it in the comments. I'd like to hear what what you know what I'm saying? What do y'all have to say about that? Alright? Yeah man. Do you agree with him? I know you you don't agree with him. <laughs> I agree with him somewhat because I understand he's a driver, but at the same time I'm in the car too, so it's vice versa. If he listen to podcasts all day while he's driving, guess what I'm going to want to do? I'm going to want to sleep. So I understand is, it, I guess it doesn't matter because I'm not the driver, so I guess I can go to sleep, but I don't want to go to sleep while he's driving because then, you know, sometimes when you have when people in the car and then you start sleeping, then they draw the sleep from you, so so they gonna wanna um, sleep also. So I don't want that to happen. So, but at the same time, I can't listen to podcasts okay, it's because I do not. And then that look so bad if I if I um if I have my headset and me you're driving. It's just I don't I don't know. It's a win and lose situation. But guys, tell tell me in the comment section because he wants to know if he's right or. It's not a right and wrong situation, but at the same time, is he had the privilege to do what he is supposed to do when he's driving, 
or it's supposed to be for both of us but i would like for you to put it in the comment section and tell me what you all think when you are driving with your spouse driving with your whosoever you're driving with how you do it i used to listen to um the fish when i'm driving in my car like i'm by myself i used to listen to the fish all the time but now about since december it's like i don't listen to nothing in the car no more all i'm doing is just um driving in silence talking to the lord and just you know what i'm saying looking at the views and just start thinking that's when you really you know what i'm saying by yourself that's when you really think you know what i'm saying um what you're gonna do what prepare this this is everything that start run through your head for real so moments of silence is just me now in my car it's just me and the holy spirit in my car when i'm driving when you're driving with the kids a different story they want to listen to their music and i don't want to hear all of that you know what i'm saying but he likes to listen to podcasts. He's a Pascal type of person. I'm not. I don't want to hear what's going on. I don't want to know. I, I don't want to know every day is just sad news every single day. Yes, you're supposed to know what's going on in the world, but who want to get up and listen to that every single day? I just want to listen to some church business I could dance to while I'm driving and in the mood and you know what I'm saying? And just have fun while we while we're doing a little mini road trip for real you know what i'm saying but guys remember to put it in the comment section tell me where you think that we're going five hours away from atlanta to where we going no i did not no you were saying it but i didn't say nothing at all no but you didn't say it out loud but anyway guys tell me in the comment section if you know where we're going he said he said it but I don't know. I did not say where I'm going. I didn't say. But when we get there, guys, you're going to see. Okay? I'm going to take y'all with me. Because you're always going to be with me. Because you, you guys become my family. So whatever I do, you guys are going to be in it. You know what I'm saying? Anything I do, you guys are going to be in it. To win it. Okay? So guys, I'll talk to y'all later. See you later. Um, the sign said do not enter. <laughs> Madness. You are going I'm inside. babe, enter. You are going inside. No, the drive through. I'm not. That's mm -mm. yeah, um, it's strawberry pomegranate. They may have um, blueberry pomegranate. For both? Yes. What else for you? That's it. Okay, you can pull four for your total. Uh, 10 it's then and then on top. So guys, I'm drinking raspberry pomegranate. I'm not a juice person, but when I say it tastes good, it tastes so good. And babe got the same thing. We're twinning. Twin. When I say anytime you guys stop at um, Wendy's, make sure you get this drink. The pomegranate. In Jamaica, we say, what we normally say in Jamaica? And the pomegranate, we normally say, we normally say, um, pom, um, pranganat. We normally say pranganat. When you come to America, you say pomegranate. But guess what? It tastes so good. Then I got me a chicken sandwich and we got the same thing as what we said, as I said before, we twin it. So I'm gonna put some hand sanitizer on my hair. I think I did but I think I did bought some. I don't remember. I don't think I did. I did not. I did not bring out any sanitizer, so in the in the rental car, this is what they give us. So you can wipe your hands. Wipe the car. So I'm gonna wipe. So guys, I'll be back. I'm gonna eat because guess what, girl? Oh.
hungry and we eat the 75 salt we add the 75 salt 75 they still didn't tell me where we're going 75 salt
it's so beautiful I like the trees and the scenery is everything look at that there we go exit the traffic circle on that's the South Lamar it. Avenue no, then turn right no mm -hmm. that's it no that's it Take the next the right, then your the destination will be on the right. No. Right, that's what I said. Right. I know that wasn't the... It did not look nothing like that. Mm -hmm. At all. The one that we did, because we come from a different side, remember? Right. right. So guys, this is where we're going to stay. Here. It says... The La Quinta. And we arrived. So if you don't know, no, you know, this is where we are. Um, yeah, so we're going to check in before we take out any bags because, yeah. But when I said I like the scenery, beautiful. Beautiful. It's a nice view, guys. We just checked in. And... So there's a door in the back maybe it's on the other side maybe it's over there so guys we just checked in and, um right here i guess so we're going to the back to um to go in our room and address it right under okay. the light <laughs> you're so funny you're mm -hmm. gonna park under the light like yeah. you're, not, you're not gonna park yeah, park under the light no back back way mm -hmm. yeah back, back way that's what you normally do. You don't normally park for it. You can't be bag in the back. That's why. It's okay. We still can do it. Yeah, we reach at a normal time. So we reach at 5. What is what it was? 5.15 or 5.07? Something like that. 5.07. Yeah, so it's not so bad. The sun is still up. And you know that night don't go, go down until 8, 9 o'clock. 8, 9 o'clock. So tonight is the viewing, so we're going to get some details, then we got to get ready to go to the viewing, and tomorrow is the funeral, so I don't know, we need to take a shower and get ready, and who's on out, most likely it's going to be at 8 o'clock, or at 6, so guys, I'm going to show you, give you a room tour in a minute, see you in a minute. Okay guys, we just made it in the
what y'all tell me if I'm an old person or not. I have to bring my disinfectant and I spread a bit already. And I have to bring my whole sheet to spread on the bed. I don't like to sleep on hotel, um, hotel spread for real. So put it in the comment section if it's just me or you guys do the same thing. I just spread, literally spray the bed. And everywhere I go, this got to go with me. So yeah, guys. So I'm rearranging, putting up my stuff for tomorrow. But I just took out my sheet because I got to spread it on the bed tonight. That's how I'm going to sleep. Yeah. Oh, we crossing the bridge, but you know I can't see the water good because it's going so fast. I can even see. Oh, there is the same thing. It's the same thing. So, guys, we're in Florida. Yeah, it's beautiful though. I cannot see the water properly. We're in Florida. Welcome to the Sunshine State. Take a shower when I get back. I'll take a shower. No big deal. Yeah. So and I don't know because it closes at um, seven o'clock. I know it's six thirty. So we're pressing for time. We're eighteen minutes away. We sit for time, we hungry, but can't get nothing to eat until we're finished. Yeah, and I show respect. In half a mile, use the right two lanes to take the exit toward Highway 17 South. It's still going. I have nothing in my mouth. They say it's good for high blood pressure. So yeah. So if you have high blood pressure, or if you don't want to get high blood pressure, I don't have high blood pressure. Use the right two lanes to take the exit um, toward Highway 17 South. It's a cure for you not to get high blood pressure. So yeah. So maybe continue for half a mile. Not. My baby is doing some listen. And I tell you, well, you guys, it prevents high uh, blood pressure. In a quarter so, mile, use uh -huh. any lane to take the ramp One to day, Highway 17 I was South. I'm coming down the stairs and I, I hear a voice say, put um, not make in your mouth. And when I went down the stairs and I told my mom, she's like, it's not no voice. It's the Holy Spirit tell you to do it. And I said, what is it good for? And she says, um, it's good for high blood pressure. It prevent high blood pressure. Use any lane to take the ramp to Highway 17 it's South. Like then use any lane to turn left onto Highway 17 like South. That. And then when I run to work, I had a PCA. Um, what is it good for? And At the she light, told me the use same any thing. lane to turn left onto Highway, Highway 17 mom. South. Well, she told me the same thing. I should say it's good for if you're like having a stroke, it like reverse it. And I'm telling you, like two weeks ago, I feel all of this side was like hurting. Even before I told her about that, it was hurting me really, really bad. And when I went to work, something I said, share the, share the message. Tell somebody. And when I tell her, she said, do you know that it's good for, like, it reverses stroke? And I said, do you know that this side of my face was hurting like crazy? But, guys, that's stress. But, you know, sometimes you're not stress is just, um, what's that word I'm looking for? What's the word I'm looking for here? It's just um no, it's not that. It's like it's not you're not thinking, but it's like your um is oh my gosh, the word that I'm looking for 
every time I just like I can't forget I forgot the word but y'all know what I'm talking about right yes yeah, so um it's not on your it's mind a sub, it's a subconscious subconscious mind that's what I'm talking about that, that, that there you go back at even subconscious so it's yeah Keep like it's there but you don't south. know that it's there for real so yeah but anyway I would rather you get in the name of Jesus because no Continue on Highway 17 South for one and a half no miles. I sent it back to the sender. Send it right back to sender. Not at this address. So from that then forward, I start putting um nutmeg in my mouth. For who for who do not know nutmeg. Nutmeg is good for like it's like a um a seasoning. You put it in your porridge. It's from Jamaica and stuff like that. So yeah. So good for high blood pressure. So remember, if you deal with it, yeah. But anyway, guys, I'm we're on the way, and um, I don't like wig. <laughs> I don't like makeup, and I don't like wig. I like to be free. So <laughs> listen, listen. It's just who I am, and who I am is who I am. I'm just simple, natural. You understand what I'm saying a natural girl. I like to wear my hair. I put something on it and then call it call it George. I don't like the makeup and the this and the this and the no. Mm -hmm. I like to be free. Yeah. So hobbies over there. Focusing. Hey babe. Hey baby, you hungry? Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> baby say, oh yes. Uh, we'll, we'll get something to eat after first. Yeah. Something eat and I'm sorry. Are you Come with me. I know I can't vlog in there because as I told you before, so I see you. I guess when I get back home, I'm uh, gonna show you some views at the place and stuff like that. Yeah, it's not a vacation, it's just you know what I'm saying. In and out, yeah. But I check in with you guys later, okay. before you start look for your plug <laughs> say good morning good morning <laughs> morning my people morning morning <laughs> you are so funny Great morning. Great morning. <laughs> yes guys so we're gonna head out and um hopefully later on when we get back Whew. it's a chill day relaxed day hopefully maybe not but yeah i'm gonna show you the back of the hotel right here maybe you want to look up the, um, the address 
it's kind of cool down here. It's 55 degrees, but the wind, the wind, the wind, the wind is blowing. So guys, if you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. So every time I drop a video, guys, you can get notified. And please subscribe to the channel if you're new over here. But if you're not new, and welcome back the return subscriber. Guys, I thank you. I am at 1,017 subscriber right now, guys. Bless you. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Enough blessing up unto you, guys. If it wasn't for you, I would not read so far. So, guys, just thank you. Keep on tapping up the screen. Keep, keep on tapping up the screen. And God is love. And remember, put God first in everything that you do. Because he's the center of your life, my life, and our life. Okay, guys? We can't do without him, no matter what. So, we're just waiting for Bill to put in the... Um, Put in the address because we don't know where we at. We don't know where we're going. We know where we at, but we don't know where we're going. So yeah, and it's at it started at 10 a.m. and now it's nine nine one oh nine twenty five nine twenty five. So yeah, guys. no food that I eat so we came next door and we found a Jamaican restaurant knowing me I can't leave out my food so guys we're in the Jamaican restaurant and I'm gonna look me something to eat to see what they have here's our flag and it is nice and spacious and here's the table and then we have space right here we're not gonna dine here, we're just gonna get the food and eat next door. That's the same thing she said, we're looking for you. <laughs> Guys, look at my baby spreading the gospel. There's this guy outside just a while ago, we came to pump gas. And he was singing at the corner store gas station. And he just looked at baby and say, Hey sir, can I ask you a question? And Lennox was like, yeah, go ahead. And he said, are you a God-fearing man? And Lennox said, yes. And um, he said, why? And the man said, can you pray for me? And my husband went over, guys. Don't know this person, but that's how God works because we was on the opposite side of the gas pump. And for some reason, um, we said something to each other and we came to the... I'm sorry, I had to cut the video. I don't know if it's to tell you if this is the devil or what, but there's a person come park right in front of of um of them and block out the whole thing. And it's like the parking place is so big and he parked right there for some reason. And and I was showing you guys all and I was just praying for the stranger. But I tell you, I said God is using him in a mighty way. He's using us. He have a calling on his life. We have a calling on our life. You understand what I'm saying? So I was telling you that he went on the opposite side. And for some reason, I don't know what happened, but we said something to each other. And we just came to this side. Like the Holy Spirit tell us to come on this side. And we came on this side for a reason. Because you didn't give him a word, baby. Yeah, because he said he, said he was crying and said, um, I said, God, I said that the, the is is his son mother call him and tell him tell him that um they pull the plug on his son because his son was in the hospital for 30 days and um he said he was crying and mm. i tell him I, I said to him guess what sometimes you know i told him i'm just coming from a funeral to my niece passed away that's sometimes god want to move you want you to do something 
wants you to do your purpose that he's sending you that he's sending you here for. And and you don't. So sometimes if you don't move, God will move you. And sometimes when he moves you, you're not gonna like it. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes he'll take your son, he'll take your wife, he'll take your mother, he'll take your daughter, he'll take whatever. He needs to go, but you have to move. So I told him, man, you have to find a purpose in life and do what God have you here to do. So, you know, that was his word. That's a good word, baby. That's a good word. But I was telling, I was telling, um, I was telling my fans that the person come and park right here mm -hmm. in front of you and block you out. And mm -hmm. there's so many parking. Mm -hmm. He put a park right there. He's not doing anything. He parked right there. He's black on everything. But, and I was like. But the reason why blocking that guy is, is doing something there is he's, 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 he's a spot to do what he's doing. Oh, you see what I'm saying? So you. that's what he's doing. Oh, Lord so, Jesus. So, you know, that's his hustle. That's you know? So the guy parked right there because he wants to, 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 to let off his money and go on. Transaction that is going on. Yes, well, I'm not gonna. Um, I am. I am not gonna um, take away nobody bread from them or anything. So whatever he has to do, he has to do it. He gotta do what he gotta do. That's his hustle. That's his hustle. But yeah. But now we're going back to the hotel because when we said tired, is on us. We are so tired. So. Maybe I'm going to take a nap, maybe. I'm going to take a nap. Yeah. We're on the Florida coast.
Let's go in and see what they got. So guys, I purchased these in Ross. I'm going to try them. Orchid Valley Harvest. So I'm going to try this nuts. Yeah. I'm changing my life in my eating habit. So I'm going to see. And babe got. What did you got, baby? Pick up your thing and let me see. And this is what babe got. So we're going to try them to see. Just made it home. I'm so tired. Left five hours drive. I think no joke. But yes, guys, it was good and it was bad. Why it was good? Because we get to see a family member that we haven't seen in less than a year. Um, I think last year, August was a family reunion. And then um, you know, so we we meet up again. But the the, the, the bad part is you know, we have to send a loved one. A transition home to the father. The good thing about it is she was a woman of God. Yeah, God, but it was so sad. But we know that one day we all gonna go. So um but it just we just know that we all at the end of the day we all human. So you know we're gonna miss our loved one and stuff like that. So oh yes guys we had fun in the spite of everything because as we say we meet and greet and we had fun and um we made it back home safe and so on so i just want to thank you guys for all that you have done thank you for liking my video subscribing the video share the video and remember to tell a friend to tell a friend so thank you guys for all for everything once again that you have done i always want to say that in everything that you do put that first that is the center of your life and remember leave a comment in the comment section thank you for all that you have done thank you for watching my video until i see you next time bye